Hi, my name is Randall Chapman, and the payload I re uh, chose to review is the Disable Windows Defender and Windows 10. Why I thought this one was important is, is if you could actually get somebody's uh, Windows Defender disabled, then you could actually proceed to fish them through email, for example. That way they wouldn't have their antivirus, anti-malware, and anti-spyware um, capabilities enabled through Windows Defender to stop them from accidentally downloading a malicious link. So this is the actual code and then the way it goes is it just runs through the steps is what a normal um, person would do but just a lot faster at selecting different intervals. I did have to modify some of the delay times because the VM actually is running a little slower than the person that programmed this because uh, like parts of it where it's like tab 250 tab 250 that just went by way too quick i had to actually increase that to a full second so with that um, let's go ahead and run it as you can see it's going to open up defender settings and it's actually going to move through properly And then I put a little bit of a longer delay at the end so that way, um, just in case the USB ducky interface would pop up over things. But that's that. And as we can see, go in here. It says um, real-time protection is off leaving your device vulnerable and there it is and with that I thought it was important to review even though this was a simple um, uh, payload it still is one of those things where if you could actually get in on somebody's system it's actually pretty important uh, it could be potentially really damaging so, and with that, uh, thank you for watching my video.